Hello. I am the storyteller. And today we will talk about Barcelona. The Berry Gothic is the center of the old city of Barcelona. Many of the buildings date from medieval times, some from as far back as the Roman settlement of Barcelona. Catalan modernista architecture developed between 1885 and 1950 and left an important legacy in Barcelona. Several of these buildings are World Heritage Sites. Especially remarkable is the work of architect Antoni Gothi, which can be seen throughout the city. His best-known work is the immense but still unfinished Church of the Sagrada Familia, which has been under construction since 1882 and is still financed by private donations. As of 2015, completion is planned for 2026. Barcelona was also home to Mies van der Rohe's Barcelona Pavilion. Designed in 1929 for the International Exposition for Germany, it was an iconic building that came to symbolize modern architecture as the embodiment of van der Rohe's aphorisms less is more and God is in the details. The Barcelona Pavilion was intended as a temporary structure and was torn down in 1930 less than a year after it was constructed. A modern recreation by Spanish architects now stands in Barcelona, however, constructed in 1986. Barcelona won the 1999 Reba Royal Gold Medal for its architecture, the first time that the winner has been a city rather than an individual architect. Barcelona is the home of many points of interest declared World Heritage Sites by UNESCO. Minor Basilica of Sagrada Familia, the symbol of Barcelona. Palau de la Musica Catalana and Hospital de Sant Pau, designed by Luis de Menachim Montaner, included in the UNESCO Heritage List in 1997. Works by Antoni Gothi, including Part Guel, Palau Guel, Casa Mila, Casa Vicens, Sagrada Familia, Casa Batio, Crypton Church of Colonia Guel. The first three works were inscribed as a World Heritage Site in 1984. The other four were added as extensions to the site in 2005. The Cathedral of the Holy Cross in St. Olalia Gothic Basilica of Santa Maria del Mar Gothic Basilica of Santa Maria del Pi Romanesque Church of Sant Pau del Camp Palau Real Major, Medieval Residence of the Sovereign Counts of Barcelona, Later Kings of Aragon The Royal Shipyard Monastery of Pedrobes The Columbus Monument The Arc de Triomphe a triumphal arch built for entrance to 1888 Barcelona Universal Exposition. Expiatory Church of the Sacred Heart of Jesus on the Summit of Tibidabo. Barcelona has a great number of museums, which cover different areas and eras. The National Museum of Art of Catalonia possesses a well-known collection of Romanesque art, while the Barcelona Museum of Contemporary Art focuses on post-1945 Catalan and Spanish art. The Fundació Joan Miró, Picasso Museum, and Fundatio and Tony Tapias hold important collections of these world-renowned artists, as well as the Conframus Museum, focused on post-1960 Catalan art owned by Fundatio Vila Casas. Several museums cover the fields of history and archaeology like the Barcelona City History Museum, the Museum of the History of Catalonia, the Archaeology Museum of Catalonia, the Barcelona Maritime Museum, the Music Museum of Barcelona and the privately owned Egyptian Museum. The Erotic Museum of Barcelona is among the most peculiar ones, while Cosmo Caixa is a science museum that received the European Museum of the Year Award in 2006. The Museum of Natural Sciences of Barcelona was founded in 1882 under the name of Museo Martorell de Arqueologia y Ciencias Naturales. In 2011 the Museum of Natural Sciences ended up with a merge of five institutions, the Museum of Natural Sciences of Barcelona, the Martorell Museum, the Laboratory de Natura, at the Castle of the Three Dragons, the Historical Botanical Garden of Barcelona, founded 1930, and the Botanical Garden of Barcelona, founded 1999. Those two gardens are a part of the Botanical Institute of Barcelona too. The FC Barcelona Museum has been the most visited museum in the city of Barcelona, with 1,506,022 visitors in 2013. Barcelona contains 60 municipal parks, 12 of which are historic, 5 of which are thematic, 45 of which are urban, and 6 of which are forest. They range from vest pocket parks to large recreation areas. The urban parks alone cover 10% of the city. The total park surface grows about 10 hectares per year, with a proportion of 18.1 square meters of park area per inhabitant. Of Barcelona's parks, Montjuic is the largest, with 203 hectares located on the mountain of the same name. It is followed by Park de la Ciudadela, 31 hectares or 76.6 acres including the Zoo 19 Ha or 47.0 acres designed by Antoni Gothi, 17.2 hectares or 42.5 acres also 17.2 hectares or 42.5 acres 13. 3 hectares or 32.9 acres, inaugurated in 200,213.2 hectares or 32.6 acres both 11.9 hectares or 29.4 acres 9. 
10 hectares or 22.5 acres 2 ha, or 4.9 acres 2.8 miles 3,6 ten ranging from 400 to 640 meters were opened as a result of the city restructuring to host the 1992 Summer Olympics, when a great number of industrial buildings were demolished. At present, the beach sand is artificially replenished given that storms regularly remove large quantities of material. The 2004 Universal Forum of Cultures left the city a large concrete bathing zone on the eastmost part of the city's coastline. Most recently, Lynn is the first beach to allow dogs access during summer season.